Hey viewers and friends, Andrew back again and welcome to another video and I received a couple of packages um, during the past week from a couple of YouTubers so wanted to show you guys what they sent me. The first lot are from Eric aka Girls and Gore and the second lot are from Adrian or Aussie 80s. So I'll be leaving both of their channel links in the description box below. Both well worth checking out. Um, Eric makes some fantastic videos. I'm um, really, really into his horror and just a great person to talk to. Adrian doesn't make videos. However, he is one of the most knowledgeable guys that I know on here and well worth um, getting to know and talking to. So yeah, head on over and subscribe to both of them if you haven't already. So we'll show what Eric sent me. Um... So he sent me a couple of these horror collection movie packs, you know, the $5 um, Walmart ones. I'm really, really happy because obviously we don't get these here in Australia and uh, there's some great movies on them. So the first one up is this uh, six movie pack with Blood Dying Appearance, Earth Girls Are Easy, Sundown, Fido and Boy Eats Girl. The main two I wanted are Blood Diner and Parents. Then he sent me the 8 movie pack with Waxwork, 976 Evil 2, Ghoulies 3, The Unholy, Chud 2, Chopping Mall, Slaughter High and Class of 1999. I've only seen Chopping Mall and Slaughter High which I own on separate releases. Um, but this pack for those two movies alone is heaps worth it. Um, but I'm looking forward to checking out 976 Evil 2, Ghoulies 3, and uh, Chud 2. And uh, that didn't end there. He sent me a DVD uh, of August Underground. Um, this was an interesting experience and not my cup of tea at all. Um, I made it 15 minutes into the movie and um, yeah, just got sick and tired of it and turned it off. Um, definitely not my thing. I mean, I. To be completely honest, I don't really see the point in this sort of extreme horror. Um, yeah, nothing against people that are into it. I mean, everyone ha is entitled to that. But yeah, definitely not for me. But thanks for sending me this anyway to try out. Alright, now on to what Adrian sent me. So, um, we did a rather large trade in the first... A lot of things he sent me are the uh, four seasons or the complete series of Tales from the Dark Side. So season one, um, season two with fantastic cover art, season three and uh, season four. Um, I've watched about five episodes of season one so far. Um, first time seeing the show by the way and think it's absolutely brilliant. I would definitely recommend it to horror fans. You know, if you're a fan of the Twilight Zone or little horror anthology stories, um, it's well worth checking out. So looking forward to finishing that series off. It'll probably take me quite a while, but really, really enjoying it. Next up we have Wes Craven's Chiller. This is the Umbrella release. I've never seen this movie before, but Wes Craven's a director that I've been really getting into lately and, um, you know, in my opinion, I think he's definitely the most underrated horror director out there. I mean, he's got his big popular well-known movies, but, you know, he's got a lot of hidden gems under his belt and, um, as I'm slowly finding out, so hopefully this is another one of those but yeah I've never seen it before so if anyone has seen it please let me know what you think of it. Um, next up we have a wilderness slasher horror double feature of the forest and don't go in the woods alone. Um, I believe this pack is now out of print or at least going out of print. Um, it has been one that I've been wanting to check out for a while now. It looks cheesy as all hell. But yeah, sometime, not too sure when, I'll check them both out and no doubt post a review on them. So, yep, The Forest and Don't Go in the Woods Alone. And the last thing he sent me is the ultimate 
edition of Dawn of the Dead. Uh, this set is fantastic. I've seen it. Um, I've seen a few people show this off on YouTube and I've always wanted it. Um, this is a movie that I definitely need to re-watch. I've only seen it once before and it was um, last year or the year before I think I've got the Umbrella Blu-ray release of it. I um, wasn't a big fan of it but I definitely think it's a movie that needs repeated viewing from me to really get into and I've always loved this set so glad to own this one in the collection and I'll definitely be re-watching this one at some point. Um, this one has four discs and um, yeah I think three different versions of the movie so really really nice set. So that's it, that's what I've received in the way of trades from both Eric and Adrian. Um, once again Eric and Adrian thank you so much for the trades, I really really um, like what I got out of it and um, yeah guys if you're not subscribed to Eric and Adrian I'll be leaving their channel links in the description box below like I said earlier please check them out if you haven't and thanks a lot for watching.